Hey guys, Dr. Abdul Manan, GP and medical educator at Blue Peanut. Why work experience? Well, as you know, work experience is important for you because it gives you an idea. It gives you an understanding of the profession. It gives you an insight in what doctors actually do. Not only that, what it will help you to do is answer the question you'll have, which is, is it for me? You'll be able to make an informed choice, you know, to decide whether medicine is for you or not. That's why it is so important that you actually do get work experience during the journey into medicine. So the question is this, why come to our course? Well, I would argue that work experience is so important that you go and get experience wherever you can. Be it our course, be it other experience, make sure you do. But what you will get in our course, we feel is a very good product. You will find that we will prepare you well for your UCAS personal statement, for the forthcoming MMI interviews and non-MMI interviews as well. Why? Because we will cover some key concepts, key topics which you need to understand. For example, medical ethics. For example, communication skills. Talking about communication? Well, we will do in-depth communication and history-taking skills. Not only that, we will look at examination skills. We will look at how it prepares you well as a historian, as somebody who takes a history, somebody who communicates with patients. So we will do the doctor-patient communication, doctor-patient engagement thing. We won't just talk about it. We will get live actors. We will get actual patients for you so that you can engage with them as their doctor. You can be involved in taking information, understanding it, looking at management, how do you investigate, how do you then take this further and actually treat and do whatever you need to do with your patients. So you'll get a good experience of what it's like to be a doctor, not just watching, not just observing. Um, we will also talk about motivation. Why is it you want to be a doctor? Why is it you want to go into medicine? What qualities do you need to see in a doctor? What strengths do you have towards being a doctor? What weaknesses might you have? We will be reflecting on that with you so you have a good idea on your strengths and weaknesses and how you can potentially improve things as well. We'll look at UCAS personal statement in depth because we don't just want to do work experience where you hang around with us. We want to give you value added. You can go back and think, hang on, because of this, I can take things further now. In your UCAS personal statement, you'll be able to properly reflect on your experience, properly understand and portray that during your uh, personal statement. You can also take away practical skills that you can reflect on. For example, things like venipuncture, things like suturing skills. These things will help inform you as to whether a career in medicine or dentistry is one for you. You can also talk about this in your interviews, in your personal statement as well. Myself and Dr. Khan, both of us, deliver these workshops, these work experience um, sessions personally. We feel we are best at doing it because we have all the skills required. We train students in our own practice. We train medical students, nursing students, physician associates, other allied healthcare professionals, as well as junior doctors in our own practice settings. So we feel we're best placed to do that for you and with you.